Welcome back, Brigantine fans. This is Double Seventy Seven Trigger here, and you are watching Drist attacking Cadbury. Now, for this battle, this was pretty crucial, and this was a, a whole lot of fun because if I would have taken taken a huge army up against this uh, this small little team here, they would have left right away. That's just pretty much guaranteed. So I'm taking two leaders. I'm taking uh, big boobs. Taking Raphael, you know, both my uh, demon classes, uh, Drist, Thor, and the other leader will be Gallo, Trigger, uh, the Jin Dude, and Baumont. And so right here, oh yeah, I do have a fairy on my team. Uh, I think it's Tinkerbell. But um, I am trying to formulate a plan here as far as what I want to do. What would be the most devastating thing to do? Now, typically, uh, what I'll be doing is pretty much the most devastating thing to do. It's the easiest thing to do. Um, but uh, it's also slightly devastating to you, too. Um, and you're going to you know, get to see that pretty soon here. So, uh, yeah, pretty much um, putting up this wall here. I kind of didn't want to put too many monsters out there, you know, for... Um, for Kador and uh, his buddies to, you know, go around and attack. I kind of wanted them to come straight through the middle, right to Thor, and uh, you know, get bunched up there. That's kind of what, kind of what I wanted to try for. Um, so right now I'm trying to plan. Okay, where should I put my other characters so that you know, if I need to swing them around, I can swing them around, and uh, you know, it won't be too difficult because I'll be able to get by. You know. Um, you know the main attacking team up there so that's why I'm moving my uh, you know Gallo and those and his little uh, cronies down that way um, as you can see here Shirara or uh, Sirhara I just can't pronounce that name <laughs> but uh, uh, their ninja on their team of uh, Escarez is um, is basically um, doing paralyze on my Satan because they know it's more prudent for them to do paralyze and to stop a possible meteor doom than it is to actually go and attack Thor. Now he would do a really good attack on Thor. He could just run in, throw some ninja stars, and I think he probably could get about a hundred hit points off. I think it's very possible. I think it's doable. But uh, they thought that it was just you know a whole lot better to do you know that yeah I decided to speed up the video because um, I was taking a lot of time thinking about what I wanted to do uh, because for the th you know the thing is I was just a little too close with uh, Drist you know for um, that Thor hammer so I decided to pull him back one and I was thinking oh I should have had him back just to space more and then uh, it would have uh, turned out right but um I haven't used Thor in a while, so I wasn't thinking about, you know, the, I was trying to get the best possible position, but I didn't quite get it right at that moment, and I was kind of hoping that uh, Kador would go first, because, geez, it seems like every time I play against Kador, it's always, uh, you know, working out kind of in his favor that he doesn't get hit with a hammer, but I'm going to hit him with a hammer soon. I definitely am going to hit him with a hammer, and you're going to see me hit him with the freaking hammer. So... You know, here I was trying to decide, Holy Word, Meteor Doom, Holy Word, Meteor Doom. Okay, well, this guy's a bishop, so Meteor Doom it is. And pretty much everything else out there really doesn't make any difference whether I did that, you know, Holy Word or Meteor Doom. But I think Meteor Doom still will do more damage uh, in the long run. I don't have to kill the little Wyvern that came down to Gallo and friends, because if they even decided to stay, uh, they wouldn't survive it. It's just, it's just no, they would not survive that. Um, so, yeah, Meteor Doom does pretty good damage, you know, as you can see, you know, it's pretty good normal, uh, uh, well, it's, you know, not normal, but, um, it's a little stronger than normal, but, uh, it's still, still really good, uh, I did pretty decent with that, now you can kind of check out the, uh, the difference between a Satan and a Lucifer's Meteor Doom right now, you can see which one will do more damage, because, I'm pretty much going to be hitting uh, most of the same type of characters. I think the two dragons you can check out. 
I'm uh, probably going to kill off the hell dog. I think I'll be able to kill off the hell dog, so you probably won't be able to, you know, notice, you know, too much of a difference with that. But the two dragons, you get to see, you know, how much it took off and uh, all that good stuff. Uh, but yeah, Big Boobs is doing her uh, Meteor Doom and uh, going to squash the enemy, squash Kador. Oh man, hate that guy. I love playing as him, but you know when I'm playing against him, I hate that guy. He's he's just as bad as Amekus, and sometimes uh, it just he irks me even more so sometimes. Zemeckis, you know he'll run out there and do some stupid stuff and get caught in the middle, and then you can trap him and kill him. But Kador, he's he's very defensive, and he plays really well. And plus, I mean, especially for this, I mean, for some reason they're making him to be like a god in comparison to Drist, even though Drist has better attack and defense, so I don't know. But here, look at this. 499 for attack. That's what power will do for Thor at level 21. Now, that's about an average. I can't, you know, can't say that's for certain, because every time you level up, it's always a little bit different. And I know, because I've played this game enough, so... Uh, but right now, for my uh, Thor here, you're going to see some uh, good damage go out. And, uh, yeah, and I was looking at that, and I was thinking, uh, okay, yeah, I don't think I'll kill off my fairy. I think I'll get really close to killing her off, but I don't... Oh, crap. <laughs> she just died. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, man, but it's doing, like, 360, 380. 380 on him. It just, it's devastating. 359, 398. This is what I was telling you. Kill a Jindu to one shot, 350. <laughs> it's just devastating. It's 4,776 experience points. It repels him from level 21 to level 24, I believe. And, yeah, that's pretty much the end of that. He's not going to stick around anymore. Uh, pretty much scared him, you know, completely away. Um, I'm going to try a little bit of different, uh, you know, something different uh, in the next battle. You see some interesting stuff. Since I've finally formulated a really good plan... Uh, for Thor, but uh, yeah, you'll have to wait till the next battle to see that. So, uh, alrighty then, this was Devil 77 Trigger here. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I will talk to you later. Bye.